Hi, welcome everybody. We're gonna dance bomba today. Just gonna see a few minutes to see people that connect. Hi, welcome everybody. Um, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna talk a little bit um, to give a little bit of time to people to connect so we can start class right away and you don't miss anything. Hi everybody, welcome. My name is Lucy Turbe. I'm originally from Carolina, Puerto Rico. Um, I've been in New York for the last six years. I those six years, I've been part of Dance Theater of Harlem. I'm a Dance Theater of Harlem alumni. I was part of the uh, summer intensive program and the professional training program. And currently, I am a faculty member of Dance Theater of Harlem School. I've been working for the Tandu program for the last three, three years. And also, I am a teaching artist for the Dancing to Barrier program. And today I'm very excited and happy to be here with all of you and share a little bit of my culture with all of you and to teach you Bomba. Um, bomba is uh, originated at the end of the 17th century uh, when the African arrived to the coastal areas of Puerto Rico to work in the sugar cane plantation. And Bomba, uh, the African used Bomba to express their feeling after a long day of work for religious ceremonies or a special occasion and events like weddings or birthday. Um, Bomba have different, different rhythms depending on the area where it's common, coming from. And we have different towns of Puerto Rico that are very popular for playing bomba. We have the towns of Santurce, Cataño. Uh, we have also Guayama and Ponce. We have Loiza. We have Mayagüez. Uh, today, we're going to learn. Le last week, we learned Sica. That was from Santurce. Today, we're going to learn Seis Corrido. That is the rhythm from Loiza. Um, we have the most popular rhythm of bombas. Bomba are Sica, Cuembe, and Seis Corrido. Last week we did Sica from Santurce, and today we're gonna do Seis Corrido from Loiza, Puerto Rico. Uh, this special rhythm is um, very popular because it's one of the rhythm that is the faster rhythm and joyful rhythm inside the other rhythm of Bomba. And especially um, this rhythm is still dancing barefoot. Um, with the past of the year, the bomba has been changing and evolving. But actually, like right now, if you go to Loisa, people are still dancing bomba and they're still dancing bomba barefoot. So today you don't need any shoes. We're going to be barefoot. And also, um, the bomba de Loisa, we don't, they don't use skirt. Like last week we did Sica and we use a scarf simulating the, the skirt, but in the Bomba de Loisa, they don't use skirt. So you only need your body to dance and have fun. And just remember that Bomba is kind, is an improvisation. I give you a steps, but you make it your own. You make it, you feel it and you make it your own, okay? So we're gonna start. Thank you for everybody that connect. We're gonna start um, with a warm up. For the warm up, we're gonna be playing Sica. And then we're gonna learn the Seis Corrido. So let's go. You guys stand with me. Your shoulder. 
We're gonna go front, two, three, four. So that's the first thing that we're gonna do. One, two, three, four. Just that. One more time. One, two, three, four. Or if you're doing the other leg, you go one, two, three, four. Your arms, do whatever you want. You can put one hand in the hips and the other one in the front. Going toward the drummer that is playing for you, you can put your both arms up. Front, whatever you feeling, you can put it up here. How you feeling today? That's the that's the motto of the day. You're gonna do it in the way that you feel it. Okay, so that's the first thing that we do. We do one, two, three, four. The second step that we're gonna do is very easy. It's like a shuffle to the back. So we go one, two, three, four, back, two, three, and stop. So we go one, two, three, four, back, two, three, four. Or if you're doing other side, one, two, three, four, back, two, three, four. So let's do that with music. We're gonna do eight back basic step. Then we're gonna do with or paseo. We're gonna grab and then we're gonna one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Are we ready? Five, six, seven, one. Eight. 
three, four, front, back, front, together. Okay? So we got to do or paseo or back, forward, back, and there we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, together. And then we're going to do this one, okay? So let's do eight of these or paseo, front, back, and our crossing legs. Here we go. Five. Okay? 
So let's put it all together. And the last thing, we're gonna move our shoulders. Ready? After this, I'm gonna see what, how you're doing. And if you have question or something, let me know. And then I'm gonna read you. Ready? Let's do any place. Thank <laughs> you. 
breathe a little better. Write me how you're doing, if you're having fun, if you have any question, where you watching us, and then we're going to do everything one more time. We're going to do a couple of times from the top with a faster music that that's the real say corrido. If you think that this is fast, originally the music is faster than this. So it's on fire that that Bate is on fire when, when we're dancing Bomba de Loisa. Sweating like crazy. Oh my God, having so much fun. Thank you so much. Um, any question for me? Um, great, so much fun. Great, I'm so excited that all of you are having fun. Yes, we're sweating. This is the cardio. If you do Bomba every day, you will be fit by the, by the end of the quarantine, okay? Um, so let's hear the, the faster music. <laughs> Did you say faster? Yes, let's hear the faster music. That's how um, the says corrido sounds, okay? Thank <laughs> you. 
cool down, or cool down, is gonna be we are rhythm of Cuembe. That is a slower rhythm and it's from the south, okay? So let's cool down. Bomba. I learned to dance bomba when I was a little girl. I think I was when I was like around 10 years old. And I think that it's very important to know your culture and to know where you're coming from, to know where you're going for, right? So I'm very happy um, to be here last week and today to Dance Theater of Harlem to give me the opportunity to share this with all of you. I want to thank you, my two drummers, um, Victor Pablo and Emmanuel from Puerto Rico, to record this music for me. And remember to subscribe to um, Dance Theater of Harlem, Dance Theater of Harlem YouTube channel. Remember to like this video and share this video with people that you think that will enjoy it. Right. So thank you so much for joining me. If you have any question, this is the moment. Let me know where are you watching us, right? So before I close for the evening, okay? So thank you so much for joining me tonight. Have a beautiful evening. Until the next one. Bye. <laughs>